Hello everyone and welcome to Foreign Situation. Before we get this video started, please subscribe, like, and put the notification bell on so you get notified whenever Foreign Situation posts a video. And today I'll be teaching you how to make a painting of a galaxy. Step by step, I'm using a painting canvas. You can use paper or whatever you're working on. So, the materials you'll be needing are watercolors, acrylic paints, some brushes and sponge, glitter, oil paints. I'll be needing three oil paints, pink, purple, and blue. A silver glitter is optional. Watercolors, I'm using white color in them. A thick brush and a middle tipped brush and a thin tipped brush and a sponge, a black acrylic, and some water. I'm also using a canvas as I told you as an example. You can use on paper or whatever. So, first of all, I'll be using this black acrylic paint. I'm just putting a few dots on the canvas. I am spreading the black paint with a thick brush. A great way to spread the acrylic throughout the canvas without using too much acrylic is to use a little bit of water. You don't want to use it too much because your acrylics will not dry very fast. You don't want to add too much water because the acrylic will take time to dry. When your black paint has dried on the canvas, now you need to take your three oil paints, pink, blue, and purple. And then take your sponge and then apply the paint on the sponge. Right now, I'm putting pink on my sponge. And then dab the pink color on top of the black canvas. And then dab the purple color against the pink color. And then dab the blue color against the purple color. And it's your choice if you want to go blue, purple, pink, or purple, blue, pink, it's your choice. You can change it up. But you need to get the exact colors, blue, purple, and pink. And keep doing the same thing until it's reached the end of the canvas. Painting your black canvas with color. Now you're going to take your white water paint to represent the stars. I'll be showing you a technique. You have to put your middle tip brush with your finger 
so you can get that star dotted effect. And after that, draw your stars with a thin brush. I recommend to use a more thinner brush. And finally, you can use your silver glitter. I said it was an optional, but you just sprinkle it around the candles and to give the stars a more shinier effect. And that's it. The final result.